Hi, I'm Brian Van from Sport Bike Track here, sportbiketrackgear.com. Today we're going to do a video review on the brand new leather riding pants from Alpine Stars. These are the GP Plus. Leather riding pants have always been a challenge to size, so we're going to begin this video by talking about the sizing. A Stars has brought out the new GP Plus in three lengths short, standard, and long length. The short is about one inch shorter than standard, and the long are about an inch longer than the standard. Okay, so we've got three choices. Here's how we're going to recommend you choose the right length for yourself. Remember, exceptions to every rule, everyone is built differently, but historically what we've seen, the short version is going to work out well if you are under five feet eight inches tall. Okay, we're going to ask you to look at the short version, probably going to work out best for you. If you are 5'8 to about 6 feet. I think the standard length is going to be good, right? Over 6 feet, let's definitely get you in to the long length. That's going to be most appropriate for you. Next up on choosing the right size pair of pants is this whole Euro sizing thing, right? What we want you to do is take your honest to God waist size, add 18 to it. Using myself as an example, I've got a 34 inch waist. I've added 18, puts me to 52. I have on a 52 right now, and Josh, let's give him an idea of how those fit. We kind of showed you a 360 in the first part of the video, right? Front view, side, I'm gonna go ahead and get down to the riding position. The waist, the length, everything feels great. I've got them hooked to this GP Plus jacket, right? Back side, and then back to front. An exception to the waist size of rule, okay, would be if you know you've got gigantic quads, right, if your legs are just huge. Let's take an add 20, okay? It's not too often that happens, and if you're one of those guys who you know you've got tree trunk legs, right, you know who you are, there's no doubt about it, right, go ahead and add 20 instead of 18. It's gonna be the only exception really for the waist sizing rule. Other than that, the 18 has proven to be very, very accurate. What I'd also like to add is we are always available here to help you choose the right gear, the right size, the first time. We'll get you here toll free by phone at 888-784-4327 or shoot an email to orders at sportbiketrackgear.com. If you need to exchange it, we are here to facilitate that. We want you to be happy with what you got. We want it to fit right, okay? Understand that procedure is completely painless here. Never a restocking fee on the Alpine Stars gear. Let's do a feature and benefit now. Leather construction, airman based stretch panels, TPR Alpine Star logo just underneath the leather motion panel, replaceable sport knee sliders. In the quads and the hip area, we've got some energy absorbing foam. We're going to give you a better look at that when we do kind of more of the inside out review of the pants, second part of this video. CE protection, knees and shins. The bottom of these pants are actually finished in mesh. It makes them bunch less inside the boots and it also keeps cooler in that area. If you're looking at the pants right now and you're going to think, man, there's no perforation, these are going to be really hot. There is no perforation, you're correct, but all the stretch material that you see up into the hips, the inside, the crotch, and the back of the legs, that breathes and flows air freely, okay? So when you're riding, and even when you're standing, they're gonna be a whole heck of a lot cooler than you would think when you initially look at them, right? That is really the key, that the stretch material flows air. We're going to do a lot better job explaining the technical parts of these pants from the inside out. Right now I've got them connected to a GP Plus leather jacket. I'm using the full circumference zip that Alpine Star offers all the way around. Okay, And what that allows you to do, it allows you to take the majority of their leather jackets, hook them to the pants, got a nice two-piece riding outfit. This is great for street riding, canyon carving. 
even some drag day action. Most organizations with that near full circumference zip, this will pass tech and you can ride in the organization. Stay tuned for the second part. We made it a little more technical, give you a look from the inside out of the all new GP Plus leather pants from Alpine Stars. Here we go with the all new Alpine Stars GP Plus leather pants from the inside out. The knee and chin protection is CE certified. It offers a medium density outer shell, lots of energy absorbing foam on the inside, lots of flexibility. This is a protector they've adopted over the last couple of years in that area and it works great. Lots of protection, very comfortable. That is the only removable protector on this pair of pants. The liner is fixed. It offers inside of it a good measure of foam padding for the hip and quad area. Okay. There is also stitched into the pant, you can see the outline here, a tailbone protector stitched in. Full circumference zip to jacket connection here. Zipper up the crotch and we have a heavy duty metal clasp that slides together. Okay, That tidies it up right here. Lots of elasticity here in that waistband. Look at that. So it's going to hug your hips. You need a little more room. It's going to do that. And remember too, when you're on the bike and you're moving around, right, this will move with you to keep the pants good and comfortable. Down the side of the leg, screen printed Alpine Star logo. Full motion panel here in the knee area. Rubberized Alpine Star logo right here at the top of the knee. Comes with the knee pucks that you see. Not only do you have the CE certified knee and shin protector, but there is also a good measure of energy absorbing foam that is sandwiched between the knee protector and the outer leather shell. So there's a lot of protection in this general area. They have finished the bottom of the leg off with a mesh panel. That does two things. It keeps it cooler and the mesh fits inside of boots a lot easier than the leather would. Okay, so at the end of the day, it makes it easier to get the boots over the pants, keeps it more comfortable and less bulky in this particular area. Down the back of the legs, on through the crotch area, back of the knees, stretch material. The stretch material allows the pants to move on your body, keeps you comfortable, makes it easy for you to ride the motorcycle, and they also offer a good amount of airflow. This stretch material will pass air through freely. Okay, So even though you don't see a lot of perforation in these pants, with all the stretch material on the crotch, inside of the legs, back of the legs, back of the knees, they're going to have the ability to move some air through the pants and keep you relatively cool.